This is a brief demonstration of the CNTX-30-0 contrast sensor from EMX Industries. The sensor features a 3 millimeter light spot. It also features a uh, display of the relative signal level, signal strength, uh, over a range of 0 to 50. The sensor provides a 0 to 5 volt analog output signal that is proportional to the uh, value displayed on the uh, display. The discrete output on the sensor is automatically selected to operate in PNP or NPN mode and I currently have that output tied to a blue LED so whenever the th signal level exceeds the threshold the blue LED will turn on. The threshold can be manually adjusted by the switches on the front panel and the response time on the sensor is 25 microseconds. So we're going to start out by looking at a, a very light shade of yellow. Uh, it's actually a 50% uh, yellow on white. And then we're going to look at the difference between that and a 5% mix of red in with that 50% yellow. So right now I can see that the uh, signal level is around 35, or I'm sorry, 36 or 37. So what I'm going to do is adjust the threshold level so that the discrete output will turn on when the signal reaches 36. And we can see the discrete output is on and the signal is reading at 37. Now when I move into the slightly darker shade with a 5% mix of red, you can see that the signal, uh, the discrete output turns off because the signal drops below the threshold. So fairly easy for me to set that to trigger and differentiate between that very slight shade difference in yellows. Um, there is white, as you can see, there's white borders in between the uh, color squares here. So as I move through the borders, the sensor is going to turn on and off. Now we're going to set up the CNTX sensor to differentiate between two very similar shades of red. Uh, the first one, slightly lighter, is a 50% mix of yellow with a 90% tint of red. And the second shade is a 50% yellow with a 100% mix uh, of red tint. So first of all, we're going to look at the slightly lighter color and we see that it reads 22-23. So we're going to set the discrete output or the signal level to trigger at uh, 22. So now you see the output is on and we're detecting the lighter shade. Now we'll move over to the 100 percent tint and you can see that the sensor is not detecting this so we're able to differentiate between these two shades uh, very reliably. So think of the CNTX for your contrast sensor needs.